Okay. So. Uh, next thing I'm going to show you all here is how to do a proper ZFS send. Uh, and the reason I'm showing you all this today is because I have a whole bunch of crap on uh, my main host. I don't really want on here. I want it on my server. So. Um, what I'm going to go ahead and do here is open up a root prompt and do ZFS list type. file system there's your R pool and there's your volume okay so right here uh, there's a few I want to send over uh, one of them being I want to send my Nix OS over right and I want to clear out uh, my virtual machines that are right here so I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm just gonna go ahead and delete these guys right here but not delete the actual storage uh, delete 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 Delete, 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 delete. All right, so now we guys, my one main Windows rig I want in there, nothing else on there. Now I want to go ahead and send that snapshot over. Uh, let's say for the Nix OS uh, virtual machine and I want to send it over so what we're gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna type in ZFS send and we already have a command ready to go for that virus host just pretend y'all didn't see that uh, I probably won't trust my, my website now so uh, I'm gonna do Nix OS like that that's what we're gonna receive it as and uh, oh uh, before we do that we have to do a ZFS snap our pool and then Nix OS and then we have to an app and I'm just going to send now so you have to take a snapshot of it usually first because we're going to send the snapshot so now we're going to do ZFS send do this Nix Nix OS like that and Nix OS at send now so when I push enter, what that's going to go ahead and do is going to go ahead and SSH to my main rig, then do the ZFS receive on that side. And as you can see, it's now sending that snapshot over. <clears throat> so if y'all want to see uh, how it's being sent over, it looks like we're going about 300, yeah, no, 300 megabytes a second, roughly, up and down. Uh, I'm going to show you uh, what it's being sent over and how. So I have a 10 uh, G uh, fiber optic card, and let me go ahead and turn on my camera. And I'm gonna try to, anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and give y'all a view. Uh, the snapshot already sent over. The snapshot already sent over, right? So it's sent over. I'm just trying to give y'all a view here on how it's sent over. So, right here, I have some fiber optic cables. They run down here from my main rig. They go up here, they go over here, over there, and then they go back, and then back to the server. Now, yeah, they go right here. So, uh, this fiber optic cable, you see that light blinking? It's tangent, so it will go to a gigabyte a second in the server. Where it puts those NVMe drives. Uh, you can see it's too. That's how it's sent. So now, so y'all saw how that sent over. So that was sending a uh, ZFS over the network. So again, if y'all want to go ahead and do that, there's the command. It's a simple command ZFS send. Dash V, R pool, and Nix OS, send now, and you're SSHing to the rig you want to SSH to, then you're sending. You want to make sure you do an SSH copy ID first, that way it doesn't ask you for the password uh, when you're doing the send. That way it has the key connected to that server. So, anyway, that's it. If you like, like and subscribe.